Hello, this is Heyeonju, and I'm the Peach Board student in Chemical Engineering of SKKU. Today, my presentation topic is to overcome the colonization resistance of probiotics to enhance the delivery efficiency. A microbiome is a generic term for microorganisms living in various environments, including all the related genetic information. In humans, more than 80% of microorganisms exist in the intestine, and then the microbiome is mainly composed of beneficial, intermediate, and harmful bacteria. Usually in healthy people, the ratio is, as like the graph on the right, it's 25% of beneficial, 15% of harmful, and the rest of them are intermediate. Intestinal microbiome digest the food that we eat, and the metabolites which are produced by them are known to affect the physiological activities. And sometimes the intestinal environment can give us the signal for specific diseases. Therefore, these days, controlling the microenvironment and especially increasing the ratio of beneficial bacteria have become very hot issue in this field. Probiotics is one example of the beneficial bacteria, and they actively regulate immune cell activities and has close relationship to our health. Therefore, many people are very interested in consuming fermented foods and probiotic supplements for their health. However, recent probiotics has fundamental limitation that they cannot be colonized to our microenvironment because of the colonization resistance phenomenon. Basically, our body has a resistance to foreign invaders and antigens to protect ourselves. So even if the probiotics has useful functions, still most of them cannot be settled down but then be discharged within just a few days. So even if we consume a large amount of probiotics, we cannot expect a significant long-term effects. Therefore, I started this study to overcome these problems. So I started this study to overcome the limitations by click chemistry reactions. For the conventional probiotics, when they are ingested to our body, most of them cannot bind to our intestinal environment, but then be discharged because of the colonization resistance phenomenon. Therefore, there could be a shifted change in our body just for temporarily, but then be returned to the original state which is called resilience. So I will engineer the probiotics to deliver them efficiently using bio-orthogonal click chemistry reaction, which means it will not affect and will not be affected by any other physiological re reactions in our body. Then it will enhance the introduction efficiency and proliferate and finally change the intestinal environment. I believe this strategy will overcome the conventional pro problems of probiotics. Recently, this probiotics industry has become larger and larger. Not only related to the health, probiotics also have close relationship to the beauty, the cosmetic market. Incremental growth and the speed of market growth has recently increased dramatically and this implies that the market will have positive impact to our lives and our society. So I believe my, my future field will have a very potential to the better society and the better industry of the probiotics. Thank you for listening.